Hello what's up art lovers I am Nirma and in this video I will be showing my way of warm up exercises for art This is for everyone either it may be for kids or adults who have this urge to paint I have seen certain people who want to draw but they get stuck so thought of doing this warm up tutorial like sports need warm up exercises similarly an artist need to warm up lines and shapes act as a skeleton of any artwork either it may be sketching or painting combination of these plus adding color in a proper way will create a beautiful artwork i'm using brustros 0.3 mm pen but you can use any pen for this and also i will be using a grid book from ayush paper so any book any book you can use for the warm up thing as you have seen my first book what i have used was just a simple journal book wherein i have used only two lines to do these uh, lines and shapes so firstly i'm going to do the line from top to bottom you have to just draw a line from top to bottom top to bottom okay several lines you keep on doing whole length of the page okay hmm top to bottom top to bottom so this is what you have to do and next similarly we are going to do a straight standing line like the previous one but in a opposite side like from bottom to top bottom to top here it goes bottom to top so you have to do entire length of the page initially you may take some more time okay so later on after pra several practices it will require only a less time now thirdly we are going to do a slanting line from bottom to top bottom to top slanting line from bottom to top okay if it doesn't come properly it's okay just go on doing it okay so this is the forward slanting line okay so next we'll be doing backward slanting line from top to bottom top to bottom top to bottom backward slanting line okay here it is so again we'll be doing one more set of slanting line which is backward slanting line but from bottom to top you'll be doing bottom to top backward slanting line now the next slanting line will be forward slanting line but it will be from top to bottom top to bottom okay top to bottom yes you can take own time to do this you need not just rush in to do it initially you may take some time to do but later on you will increase your speed a little bit okay so next is a spiral which is in the right direction okay you have to do spiral in the right side direction how much ever you can spiral to the right side direction If a person draws daily will require less time to do this but if a person does art once in a month may require more time to do it 
the next again we are going to do spiral but to the left side of the direction okay left side of the direction spiral to the left side of the direction so this spiral is to the left side of the direction this is a backward curve line from top to bottom okay top to bottom these curve line can be used to draw some bushes and all when i teach you step by step you'll come to know with these lines okay in the next tutorial in the upcoming tutorial so again you draw the same uh backward curve line from bottom to top bottom to top okay now the next line we will do is like a inverted cup shape from left to right direction again we will do the same kind of curve line but in the u direction from left to right i am just doing only a little bit due to less space and next i'll be doing l from top to bottom l okay l shape then again i'll be doing another line which is of 7 the shape 7 okay so next i'll be doing is set of horizontal line continuously four lines horizontally which is not too near not too far a set of four horizontal lines that's it okay so i'm writing the direction also so that you can refer it Now next we will be drawing another set of line which is vertical same thing like you know set of four lines vertically not so near not too far continuously set of four lines Now next we will be drawing set of four lines in a horizontal way as well as the set of lines in the vertical way we are merging the previous two lines okay in this form next we will be merging a uh, forward slanting line and a backward slanting line okay see these two lines which will give you the shape of a mountain and in fact it is uh, used to draw the mountains itself so next we will go to certain shapes okay so now we will be drawing circles circles if it doesn't come in a similar size that's okay the motive is to draw circle that's it so again i'll be showing you certain shapes to draw 
now we will be going to draw triangles however you want to take the direction you can just take the motive is to draw a triangle that's it need not worry about the different sizes and all just you randomly draw the triangles and after that we'll be drawing squares okay you again need not worry about the directions which you want to draw the square however you are comfortable in drawing the square just draw it randomly next we'll be drawing rectangles okay so these shapes are uh, necessary in drawing so many things for example uh, rectangle and square and this triangle all these three uh, can create a house so next you draw cylinder just draw multiple cylinders this cylinder you can use it to draw branches of trees so randomly draw cylinders of different sizes also you can do not a problem so next what you are supposed to do is that put a very light pressure on your pen or pencil and draw several horizontal and vertical lines okay separately a set of horizontal line and a set of vertical lines and try to create in a very uh, different types of pressure you put on the pen or pencil okay so some may come in the way of uh, darker shade some may come in the lighter shade so that also will help you to uh, draw so many things okay so for today's tutorial is all about the basic shapes and lines so merge of these lines and shapes will give a beautiful artwork so practice practice and practice that will really help you a lot this foundation will help you even in sketching as well as for your painting too so that will come to know when you just do artwork okay thank you for watching if you are new to the channel kindly subscribe to my channel also click the bell icon to get notified also follow me on instagram and like my facebook page art hugs and peace namaste